guys. Thank you for tapping in with me again today. And if you're new to the channel, I'm Cleveland. So we're back in the house. We're in front of this beautiful 75 gallon. But what's going on with it? Looks like it's under construction. It is. So um, I went and pulled a bunch of this uh, live rock from the 225 I have in there. They don't need it. They have actually too much rock in there. There's big fish. Anyway, so I rescaped their tank. I should have recorded that, let you see that, but you'll see that in an updated video. So I pulled all of this from that aquarium and I started scaping. I started scaping away. It's looking great. And I thought, ah, I should show you guys. I should do it with you guys. So here I am, picking up from where I just was, uh, from where I left off at. And we're going to go ahead and start on this side. So I did the right side already. I think it's pretty much situated. But again, you can't really see it because the light is off over there. So uh, let's go ahead and get to this side. Go ahead and do some more scaping, moving stuff around. And let's get this thing looking the way that we know it could look. I mean, fortunate enough to have a 225-gallon aquarium with about 600 pounds worth of uh, live rock right here. So uh, let's go ahead and scape this thing. How's everything going with y'all? Escaping any tanks today? <laughs> That's funny, right? Kind of corny. <laughs> oh, well. Let's go ahead and, uh, you know, it's a trip. Like, sometimes when I'm doing the little cleaning videos, you know, some of y'all will be like, man, I'm cleaning my tanks today, too. I'm doing a water change today, you know? So, it ain't no telling what y'all got going on today. My babe over there laughing at me because I said, was y'all doing some scaping today? <laughs> All right, so... Let's get a little bit more light over here. So now I got another cave. These caves, I'm so, man, I'm so glad and lucky to have these caves on hand. Got a few of them. Let's see, where is that? Okay, there's the star pileup right there. And I might not even be able to use all this rock because uh, this tank is not that big. Got to make sure these gobies don't try to jump out on me. One just broke the surface, the water surface right now. Yep. Get all that out the way. And this one actually has some zoe on it. And it's doing kind of bad because the, uh, the goby keep blowing sand on it. So I put that up top over here and see if that will make a difference. Maybe it'll help it out. I think so. it's supposed to feel light too. Well, you know, no, if it if, if it's too bright for the for the Zoe, it won't really help it actually. It'll work against it, you know what I mean? Different corals need different light requirements, different par. Alright, so got that side open over there couple different options I got this cool this cool rock right here I was thinking I could either put this one on the bottom that way the gobies the uh, the crabs uh, the snails all of that stuff they could go under there and uh, make that their home because you know gobies like to dig so let's go ahead and get this all the way to the corner and you said Sally Oh, yeah, where is Sally at? Sally's somewhere tucked off. Probably underneath. Man, I haven't seen Sally this whole time since I I've been did. messing around in here. All right, cool. All right, look at this rock. That one's chunky. And we got all this rubble. This is not quite rubble, but it's small in comparison to that one. And then here's the cave. So we're going to slide this cave right over here, just like that. All right, bring it closer. There we go. All right. Oh, yeah. Just like that. So that's going to give it some depth. That's what we want. We want to yeah, get it some great. depth. All right, now we're going to... So with that one, a little bit bigger, just like that. And then, it's all right. Just like that. That looks really good. And 
then we got this big one, like I said, with the height, baby, with the height. Look at that. All right, so now I got a bunch in the front that I could, uh, I need to figure out what I want to do with. I got, a, got some nice pieces left. Looks like I got almost all the pieces that I just bought. I'm going to fill them in, though. First, I'll remove them and then put them back in where it'll be ideal and look the best. But look at that. Crazy, right? Yeah, it's been a busy day. Getting things done. I really like it. It makes such a big difference. Thank you, Barrett. That's what we were trying to get to. So that's usually where most people want to get to with the corals. You know, have it stacked up like this. Just, just cost a lot of money. So it'll take some time to, to get everything up to par. I can take out all these little pieces. All right, so we got this, this one right here. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, he did. Oh, man, I was watching him the whole time. Not even really tripping until he just, because he really got a little too close. Yeah, he was, yeah, yeah that was funny. <laughs> did you catch him on camera? Oh, man, that was funny. Oh, man, yeah, that was funny. That definitely was, that definitely was funny. Ah, that way. man. Yeah, I wish you would have got that. Oh, well. We may not. We have to go back and see. Maybe. Mm -hmm. funny. Look down there. And he just. <laughs> <laughs> he right like, yeah, you get, you get close. But that's what they do. You know, they basically. Yeah, what they'll do is like they'll. It's, it's a complete defense. Like they'll put out their spines and they'll just like start going towards you. You know what I mean? So in case you try to get close to them. You know, you get hit. You know, they don't just like try to attack like they could just, you know. <laughs> More of a defense. All right. Learn something new every day. I might be wrong. Hey, I might be wrong. You know, that's just my understanding. Just my understanding. Makes sense, huh? Ah. This water, now this water is warm. This water feels good. So, let's bring this more into the center. We'll bring it back to this side, should I say. All right. Now, I got to get this coral, this Duncan coral been doing bad since I, since I got it. Put this one. I feel like it doesn't really like the light too much so i'm gonna put it right there surprisingly maybe i should investigate get a little par reader so i can see what the par is inside this aquarium or the different levels so i can position the corals in the right in the right places all right got that one there got that one there Okay. So now, just positioning these pieces in different areas. You know, like I said, I'm not going to be able to use it all, but got some nice purple ones that I do plan on getting into this aquarium. Why not? Why not? All right. OK. 
Okay, so now this is a little too close to the glass, and I might just leave it. Take the take these two out. Let me see how that look. That might be it. Now I just gotta clean it, but that might be it. I think that is. Have the nice rock wall. I mean, I still got some rock I could throw into some of these other aquariums, which is cool, you know. Um, got some more rubble. Get that on the bottom of there. All right. So yeah, that might that might do it. That might do it. In fact, that is going to do it. I like it. Okay, so now, I mean, it looks like this thing needs to be clean. That's for sure. Got to vacuum that stand. Get that all that crud up out of there. But other than that, it's looking good. And as you can see, all the fish are still looking healthy. Let me go ahead and put this canopy back up here and, uh, yeah, and get it going. No, you don't have to be back. Let's just keep it going. I, I, for a minute, I just started working and uh, and wasn't even thinking about the fact that you were still recording, but you just brought me back to reality right there. Oh, my goodness. You know when you watch things happen, just make sure you don't watch my crack. Make sure you don't watch that. All right. I feel like it. No, the crack's not out, but my pants, but my uh, underwear showing. You get to slide that back up there, babe. It's all good. Go ahead and put it up there. All right. Okay. So I want to see this thing lit up. I want to see how this new rock aquascape is going to look. There we go. Wipe it. Oh. Forgot the damn lids. And, but you know what? I am going to go in there and, uh, and, and siphon that out. That's, that looks bad. Yeah. All right. So uh, as you just heard, I, there's a couple of things that I need to do. And then um, we're going to come back for a montage right now. I got to go ahead and uh, siphon that me uh, vacuum out the sand a little bit, take out, take out a little bit of water and then um, get the lids back up there. Be back for a montage. Be right back with you. All right, y'all. So that about wraps it up. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope that you learned something. I hope that you were inspired by something. If you were, if this is your first time here, Hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell so you know every time I upload. And everybody, if you in fact enjoyed the video, like the video. We'll catch you on the next one. Peace.